Hello everybody, this is Dr. McBrick and I am here with Lego Set 10771, the Carnival Thrill Coaster Toy Story 4, 4 Plus set. I have two of them and I have combined two of them. And this is what you get, one combination of what you get if you combine two of them, pretty much about the only combination you can get, um, given the parts and things and pieces and things like that. Um, so what I did was basically I used all of the parts in this particular set. I bought two boxes um, and uh, I used all the parts and I didn't want to use any extras, although I did have to use four extra pieces and I'll show you what those are in a second. But anyway, I use these pieces and I combine them um, with the extra track and things. I was able to do this type of track. So the kitties have a really nice long track to go on instead of that little circle that they originally had. And what I did was basically combine the two entrance ways and make an entrance and an exit. Um, so that way um, the car could roll up here and you could start to load and then you could uh, um, also exit the, the, uh, the ride at the end. Um, so anyway, so that's kind of what I did. Um, it, real simple to do that. You basically just take the uh, two entrance um, ways that are made and you only need three of these particular pieces here these printed pieces So you have one left over and you basically just add them together now The part that I used that didn't come with this set is a two by four green plate to connect these together You could use a two by four purple plate or really any color you wanted But I think purple or green would look best this way It looks like it's kind of connected through the metal of what would be the entrance way there um, So and I was able to use three of the flags and what I did basically was take because I didn't use all of the cars I took the three by one um, tile pieces finishing tiles and put those on there to make this entrance way a little bit bigger and then I used the um, the the yellow orange pieces whatever the color this color is called I use these to kind of simulate a um, stair step and uh, uh, exit ramp that sort of thing so that way you get two um, entrance and exits uh, the entrance with the turnstile and the exit with uh, this uh, kind of suggestion of a uh, of a stair here now the other pieces that I had to get and again I apologize for this ugly green card table but I'm still waiting on my IKEA tables um, and uh, the other pieces that I had to get, I had to get three of these two by two gray bricks. Now these are the um, stands, the pylons that hold the track up all the way around. Um, I was three short because of the extra size of the track and because I didn't use um, this piece here, which actually takes up a lot of, um, of those, uh, those uh, two by twos, if you notice. The other thing I did was I added one more car. Now I had six uh, roller coaster cars um, because I combined the two sets. However, if I put all six on there, it would just look too too huge um, and it would take up you know most of the track. But I didn't like the three because the three was kind of puny. But this, as you see when it goes around, it does look much more like a caterpillar um, and kind of like it's supposed to. So um, the four I think is the sweet spot um, to make it look good. And I also added, I also stuck this on a, um, a 48 by 48 base plate plus a 16 by 32 base plate so that you can see it really is large once you put it together. So if you're going to put it together, um, you could put it together on the floor or if you have base plates, um, it's going to take up quite a bit of room. So as we looked over in Figsdale, um, we're going to add more tables back here and stuff. Um, but at some point, um, we're going to run out of room as we add tables on the si that side, on this side, and all the way back here. Um, you know, it's going to take up quite a bit of room because we still have the big roller coaster um, to do, which is sitting over on the shelf right there. We have the Joker coaster, which is sitting in that white box on the shelf over there. Um, so we have a lot of stuff to do. So we're not sure if we're going to add this right at the moment to uh, Six Figs. Um, over Figsdale, our amusement park, um, or if we're just going to use these track pieces to maybe embellish the Joker Manor and uh, have one huge roller coaster. I'd like to get a kitty coaster in Figsdale. Tell me what you think in the comments down below um, and uh, see if, uh, you know, if you really think I should get a kitty coaster. I'm, you know, I think I should, but at the same time, it's just, uh, I think the Joker Manor coaster could be embellished a little bit more given, given the uh, extra pieces of track that we have here. Um, this does make a great little set. You 
you know what? If you have the money, buy two. Your uh, kid that's playing with it will really appreciate it because it will actually be a decent size little thrill coaster for the little ones. So, and it's it's real simple. It's basically you just build it, and um, I can show you here. Just uh, grab, turn around here, and have kind of a try to balance the camera and balance everything. Um, you see, it does end up with all of these parts. Um, so you do you do come up with two Buzz Light years. Um, you come up with with two of these and, and you can't have enough of these. You could have thousands of these and still simulate the movie. Um, and you know, you, you get the extra printed pieces. Um, and of course, two roller coaster cars, which are absolutely cool um, if you wanna use them for something. Um, so you get a, just a, a potpourri of pieces, an extra front piece like that. Um, again, I thought, you know, I could add it to the back of this and make it go um, either way. But then I thought, no, it looks more like a caterpillar this way, I think. Um, so I kind of like it like that. Um, and then you'll, you'll have a couple extra finishing tiles and some things of that nature. So you do get some extra pieces in case one of your roller car coaster cars breaks down. <laughs> you got you got one of these, right? Um, <laughs> but uh, anyway, um, so that is the Thrill Coaster combined into two sets. Um, we really uh, uh, think it turned out pretty well. And again, you know, it's if you're looking for a decent little roller coaster for your little one, for your kid, four plus um, or four or minus, I guess. Um, if you know, if you're looking for something like that, um, this two sets would probably be better than one if you have the money to do so, because it does give you a substantial little coaster um, from uh, with which to play, and uh, and I think you your your little one would get a lot of. Uh, a lot of fun out of this coaster. So with that said, please like this video below. Subscribe if you uh, really like our videos. And uh, remember that uh, we are a part of the BrickTubers network. Um, and uh, that link can be found in the description. Um, we really appreciate all of your support, all of your comments. And uh, um, just we just ap appreciate you all taking the time out of your life to uh, view our videos. Thanks so much for watching. This is Dr. McBrick signing out.